Raider Nation, bummer news. Star player Devontae Adams is seeking a trade. It's exciting for everybody in the league except for us. Bear with me, I'm outside today because my kids are at home and there's no way this video is getting out to you with me being at home. Now, he's got a wish list, Jets and the Saints. I think it goes in that order. I want him to go to the Saints. I want DC to get all the help that he can. But if it were me and his shoes, I would go to the Jets. And here's why, we're a month into the season. When you're gonna trade to a different team and there's all this new stuff coming on, you want the most familiarity you can get. You can't get anywhere close to that anywhere else in the NFL except for the Jets, I think, because you got Aaron Rodgers, he's spent most of his playing career with, they got a telekinesis of a connection. If there's any rust there, I think that shakes, shakes off very quickly. And then Nathaniel Hackett is over there. The OC, when he was in Green Bay, is now over there OC and at, at the Jets. So there's, for me, it's a no-brainer. Now, just because he has that wish list doesn't mean he gets to control where he goes. Now, that, that team has to make sacrifices. They have to be willing to trade away their second-round pick and whatever else it was that the Raiders want. Um, also, are, you know, are they going to be able to handle a number one right, wide receiver current contract that is demanded nowadays, which will probably be around $30 million, which it will have to be a new deal because he has no guaranteed money next year, so they'd have to rework a new deal to get him over there. I'm not going to you know, talk about all the details of it. I just think it makes the most sense for him to go to Green Bay. If I were him, I would do whatever I possibly could to get over there because, yeah, the other teams may have better setups to be contenders and go win, but I think that's the best place for him to go and take things to an entirely new level and have an even better chance of being a contender because you have that Rodgers, Devontae Adams connection, same playbook. Um, if there's any rust at all, again, I think that shakes off very quickly. You're not having to learn and play in real time, which is like drinking out of a fire hose. That's very, very difficult uh, to learn a new system, even if you've been in the game a long time. He'd pick it up as quick as anybody because he's a very smart player. He's a Hall of Fame player. It's a bummer he's not with us anymore. Um, but I want to hear from you guys. Where do you think he's going to land? 